Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So today I'm doing an MUA makeup palette um, review, like a heaven and earth eyeshadow palette review. Um, sorry if there's any background noises at all, it's because I'm outside. It is really sunny today. I'm in my onesie still because I can't really want to change. So yeah, um, I look really horrible today, I'm really sorry. But yeah, um, so yeah. Oh, I forgot to bring a mirror. Came yeah. back and I've got a mirror. So yeah, um, so we'll put it there, sorry. Okay, there we go. Um, <clears throat> can you guys tell me if this camera quality is good? Because I changed camera like on a different device. Um, I'm gonna go. So I'm gonna try these out on camera and I will tell you what my thoughts are on this palette. I've used this palette before, but I wanna show you on camera how it looks and stuff. I'm just gonna quickly show you some stuff. So I'm going to, uh, what's it called? Do swatches of these so you can see how pigmented they are. So as you can see, the eyeshadow swatches are very pigmented. Some are not as pigmented, but you get the gist, so yeah. Okay, so I'm gonna start using it now. So, uh, you can get the palette open. Um, yeah. So I'm going to go for a very subtle, natural kind of, I want to do dramatic, I will be wearing this for the rest of the day if it's really good but I might take it off if I don't like it so yeah as you can see I really really like shimmers so I'm gonna take the what color is this the canyon eyeshadow this is the heaven of earth palette so and I'm gonna blend it out into my feet And now I'm taking a mix the colours Tecto Night and Bedrock, loving the names, and I'm going to do it into my outer corner. Now I'm just blending it inwards. Okay, now I'm gonna do the inner corner. We have the color Aurea. Aria, I don't know how to say it. Aria, apparently. Yeah. There's not much in the corner to do on my eye, but still. Okay. Okay. I'm gonna take um, this color. What color is this? It is the baby one. I don't think I don't think I don't think I'm pronouncing these right, but I'm sorry. And I'm just gonna put it on my lid, like all uh all across because it's such a nice colour. This is more autumn, this is very autumn inspired, I think. So yeah, um, here's my eyeshadow so far. What are you guys thinking? I don't, it's not very good. I'm not very good at makeup. It's probably not the palette, it's just me. I like this eye better than this eye. This eye is much more, I don't know what's the word. My face looks big today. Okay, I'm gonna keep on building up. Oh, 
So I think I finished. I quite like it. Let me just show you. Um, I'm going to do some eyeliner in a minute, but it's not part of the review, so that's that. Um, let me complete the look first. I'll probably speed this up. And hopefully I won't lose the footage this time. Oh my gosh, my under eyes are so bad. Sorry about my bag. I've been sleeping with this thing. I mean, I'm supposed to be getting more sleep than I normally do. Probably doing really, really weird makeup faces right now, but I sorry. I oh, uh, let me tell you what I'm using. I'm using the Miss Beauty London Fine Eyeliner in Black. By the way, if you don't have never heard of the brand, it's not a good brand. It's just because I really like eyeliner. I don't know why. It's from Pound World, but yeah, if you want to buy it. Wow, that's a lot. Okay, let me just. Oh, crap. Oh, this one's so bad. Because <laughs> I have a scar across my face. Give me a moment and I will get a makeup oh, brush. Oh, wow. <laughs> so I got rid of the black eye. I'm just trying to stop it. Right, so now. Do you know what I'm going to do? No, sorry, that's not. Normally, I can do animal design with that eye, but it's different. Weird. Anyway, it's not, not very happy, so stop judging me, please. Mm. Oh my god, this is my horrible. Oh my gosh, oh, yeah, I did it, I did it. I don't know what that black mark is on my face here. Oh, wait, makeup. Oh, it's off. It's probably not off, I don't care. So, we've done our eyes. I'm going to do the star, because this is what I'm going to do. And then I'm going to see the thing that's watching. This is what I'm going to do. I'm just going to finish with the look and then I'll give you my thoughts on it. Oh, look, you know when you make it bent into your blush? Look what I just did. Oh, so bad, I hate it when that happens. I've never done it, I've already done it. And now I'm going to go with some comics because good old comics is good. So, yeah, let's do this. Oh crap, I'm going to make my comics. Oh god, that's a good one. Let me do which one's facing me. I should have done a start with that. Yeah. One minute, so. No. 
not really under the cotton. We're gonna get some green and then I'm gonna put this on the base. Yay. You know, I bought this backpack, it's a gloss tube thing. I really like this. It doesn't match it though, I'm gonna put it on here, it's just the best. I love this, I'm probably gonna go back and get them in a bit of an old one side of now. I'm going to get this one. It's sleeping to the camera. It's, it's in real life, it's more of a orangey red, but on camera it's a really dark red. It's not dark red, but like proper like uh, pigmented red. But it's not that pigmented in real life, but I still love it. It's still really nice for wearing on camera. I don't know if this the, the theme bob suits me, but uh, oh well. So... We got that on. Now what do I want? Oh yeah. Okay. So I finished my look. No, the okay, let me tell you. It doesn't really match. It clashes a lot, but I just love this lip. So oh crap, do you see that? Uh -huh. mm, I just really like this lip. I'm gonna go back and get them in different shades. I just really like the colour. Um, so yeah, um, let me rate the MUA product for you. So it's okay, there's quite a lot of fallout. Like, look, let me just dab my brush in there for you to see. Ugh. Okay, so if I put my, um, if I put this on, do you see the amount of fallout there is? There's quite a lot. And um, when I tap my brush, there's a lot of fallout. I don't know if you can see that, but there is a lot right now. You can't see it. Okay, well, there's a lot of fallout, so. Bearing that in mind, so yeah. The colours are really pigmented. It's good if you're on a budget, because I think this was £3.99, which is really good for a palette. And for the amounts of colours you get, it's amazing. You get how many colours? you get 12 colours for four pounds i don't think you can get a better price anywhere else it's quite good if you're like a first beginner which is me so that's why i'm using it it is okay i don't really wear eyeshadow that much i wear more of winged eyeliner so i don't really use this palette but i don't use any eyeshadow palettes normally oh crap there's a lot of wind <gasps> so yeah um i really hope you enjoyed this video um, please like and subscribe. Um, so yeah. Bye. Love you.